What is up, guys? What's up, man? What's going on? How you doing, man? So today, uh, we actually have our first guest on the show. Exciting. Yeah, I've known this man for, for 10 years. Plus. Yeah, probably <laughs> yeah, 10 years plus. He is a multi-talented guy, especially now due to the pandemic. He can cook clean, <laughs> and when he's not cooking and cleaning, he is fixing up cars and doing the most, always. But most importantly, actually, on a serious note, he is a fiance to a beautiful woman and also a father to his beautiful two-year-old daughter. So welcome. Welcome one of my best friends. His name is Joseph Wallace. But, uh, it's a pleasure, man. A.K.A. known as Chowder. <laughs> Ever since I've known this guy, um, it's been Chowder. I, I Actually, I think I know... I knew you by Chowder before I actually knew what your first name was. Uh, most people do. <laughs> yeah, yeah. So first name is Joseph, Joseph Wallace, but uh, yeah, it goes by Chowder. So how you doing, man? How's the fam? How's everything going through the pandemic? Hanging out, man. Yeah, you know, trying to, trying to survive, you know. Yeah, dude, trying it's tough. Trying to stay away from all the crazies and all that. You it's know? tough, dude, I bet, man. It's, it's, I mean, it's tough for everybody, right? But especially you, you know, you got your daughter running around. Right, you got to take right, care of her. And right. That's that's a that's a whole nother level right mm-hmm. there. You yeah. know, that's a that's a world I never thought I was going to have to get into. Yeah, but it's I mean, it's it's tough. But at the same time, like it it allows you to like hang out with your your family a little it bit does. more. You know, you're at home more and stuff. It's so definitely pulled a, uh, me closer to my daughter and my my fiance for for sure. You know, um, you know, overall, overall, I can say that this pandemic has overall helped me in my relationship with my daughter. Not not only my daughter, but my fiance. Yeah, yeah. So it's it's a good thing, you know. There's there's pros and cons to everything, right? So. Yeah, I was kind of thinking the same thing, dude. Like this pandemic, I don't want to say it's like a good thing, but right. staying home with the family and kind of just spending more time with them and not worrying about, I don't know, like going to like a good restaurant, like a bar or concerts, or you just focus on, I don't know, just staying home and working if you have to or whatever but yeah i mean it's for for the most part you know um you know i I get to see my daughter constantly every single day i never thought i'd be a stay-at-home dad or (laughs) a a housewife you know but you know here we are you know i honestly i never thought in my whole life i'd be able to have two months off of work yeah i never i never thought and then also get paid for it right so i mean exactly unfortunately you know unfortunately you know you furlough you know a lot of people got furloughed and stuff right, so right but you're on that unemployment stuff so you know you're still getting money still for getting money still getting money getting paid to, you know, to cook and clean and stuff and <laughs> more more than i am when i was working so that's <laughs> that's a shame but yeah. <laughs> i saw someone tweet that it's like why do i have to go to work and make less money for than people who are like on unemployment right yeah I'm, i mean i'm making more i travel you know 30 plus miles a day in order to work and I'm still getting paid less than I am on unemployment. Yeah, I'm dude. sitting my ass at the house. You know? So, <laughs> and then on top of that, you're also saving money. So exactly. you're saving money because exactly. that, yeah, that saving... drive, that gas money yep. and yep. you know, I'm sure lunch and stuff, you know, yep. you'd go out to eat. Yeah. But you know, my daughter does eat a lot. So hey, <laughs> yeah, yeah, I do too. So. <laughs> Being at the house constantly doesn't help at all, but it does help with going out and spending money on food and you know, all that, all that stuff that I would have when I was working. But Overall, yeah. Um, I mean, it's it's definitely pulled me closer. You know, I've I've got to see my daughter a lot more. She knows me more as who I am as a father. You know, because um, when I was working, you know, I was working constantly. Um, my girl's working too. Uh, she's actually been working through this whole pandemic. So, you know, I've gotten to experience cleaning. You know, cooking. Yeah, doing, you know, <laughs> doing the th- doing the things that she would do right, before. Right, right, yeah. And I really get to see like what she was doing, and I I, I kind of took advantage of what she was doing. And now that I'm there doing it, yeah, it's it's, like, it's a whole other world. You know what I mean? Like yeah. appreciate it more. Exactly, yeah, exactly. More appreciation. Yeah, like I just feel like so grateful, and you know, for what she was doing prior to me, or, you know, prior to the pandemic and all that stuff. So, I mean, overall, I, I really can't say. You know, I can't I can't say anything bad about her. You know, she's a she's she's a great mom. You know, yeah. She took care of me, not only me, but you know, my daughter and all that stuff. Um, yeah, that's great. Shout out to Vidi. Right, right. Shout out to Vidi. <laughs> she's a, she's, a, she's a, a real one. <laughs>